So, if you know me, you know that I love to give three tips. The power of three is so beautiful and so magical in so many ways. So today's three tips are from uh, the class that I just taught on Arabic with double turn, Arabic one, two, three, or we used to call it Arabic drop, 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 and the Egyptian. So tip number one, transitioning your feet from the two count Arabic step, which is done on the balls of the feet, to the four count step Egyptian. One, two. So the little tip is really notice that you have to hear the and, and one and two and one and two. Because we're gonna plant our left foot on the and so that our right foot is ready to go on the beat of one for the Egyptian. So let's look at this transition. Two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one and two and one and two and one and two and one and one, two, one, two. Transitioning from Egyptian into Arabic is a lot easier, I think. Um, at least it is for me. And that is because we are securely centered with our left foot and we merely step on the ball of the right. Right? It's as if we're in our Egyptian and instead of doing one more Egyptian, we're looking at the cues in the arms, but the foot pattern hasn't had to make such a drastic change as it does from the Arabic two-step to a flat ball, flat ball, flat ball, flat ball, 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 ball flat ball, flat ball. So from the Arabic to the, from the Egyptian to the Arabic, we get this little push up. And from the Arabic to the Egyptian, we have to plant that left foot down. Push up. And we get that push up also in our ribcage lift on the one. Egyptian back, two, three, four, Arabic up. Good, tip number two. We were looking at the difference between the Arabic and the Arabic drop, drop, drop. Arabic step, the emphasis on the beat, on the rhythm is we're thinking the uplift, the uplift of the rib cage on the beat of one. Return to neutral on the beat of two. So it's up, neutral, up, neutral, up, neutral, up, neutral. When we do the Arabic drop, 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 the beat accent on the rib cage actually happens on the down. Let's see what this looks like. Up, up. So our cue, yeah? One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. Lift. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Lift, 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 drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, return. Lift, 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 drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, return. Lift, lift. Lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, return once more. Lift, lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, return. The third tip that we went over in class today was the difference uh, in the energy between um, Arabic one, two, three, 
how do you cue, what's the difference between the cue of that and cueing for your orbit? The difference is, in the Arabic one, two, three, we're traveling forward for our cue. And the Arabic orbit, we're traveling backwards and looking in the open space over the right shoulder for the cue. So here's what this would look like. Six, seven, eight. Here's our Arabic in place. Coming forward with the cue for uh, drop, drop, drop. One, two, three, four. Now this can travel backwards, but your intention is clearly keeping with the Arabic drop, drop, drop. And also this is a step that like the Egyptian, it continues until we change it. Because it wouldn't be fair to your fellow dancers to start in Arabic one, two, three with horizontal arms and then cue back into an orbit. It'd be too confusing. There's not enough information in, in the change of the body, the change of the head. So let's quickly review the difference between cueing for the Arabic one, two, three and the Arabic orbit. One. Arabic one, two, three. And even if I return to my center spot, now the cue for the Arabic orbit. Arms down, look towards that right shoulder. Wait for your partner to meet you. Then pivot around. Arabic drop, drop, drop. Sorry, Arabic one, two, three. <laughs> old, old name, old dog, new tricks. Arabic orbit cue. And those are your three tips. From the balls of the feet to showgirl posture, from showgirl posture to the balls of the feet. Arabic regular, basic, we're honoring the beat with the ribcage lift, Arabic drop, drop, drop. First two Arabics, normal. Then the down, one, two, three part. The exit on the beat is on the, is on the return. And then the third tip is cue difference between Arabic one, two, three, we come forward, we wanted to cue the Arabic orbit. We'll move back, look over the right shoulder. And that's it for today's tips. I have my handy dandy clicker to turn my camera off and on. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time. Bye.